Welcome to NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Southern California. NASA's Ingenuity Mars helicopter hitched a ride to the Red Planet on the Mars 2020 Perseverance rover, which landed in Jezero Crater on February 18th. Earlier today, Ingenuity should have autonomously performed its first flight attempt on Mars. Now the team is ready to receive the data that will tell them whether we've made history with the first controlled flight on another planet. Thank you for joining us at this early hour. I'm Marina Jurica of the JPL News Office. Ingenuity is a technology demonstration, which means it is a proof of concept experiment. After years of development on Earth, the team has one month to test the technology on Mars. Tonight, we'll talk to a few team members and then keep our eyes on the room where the helicopter operations team will be receiving and studying their data. So the helicopter does not have a radio that can talk directly to Earth, so we need the help of the rover. As a matter of fact, the rover has an instrument on board, which is also built by the helicopter team called the Helicopter Base Station. The Helicopter Base Station has a radio which talks to the helicopter. So as you have, have heard, earlier today, the helicopter flew as it was flying, and after it landed, it transferred its data to the base station. And then the rover takes the data from the base station and transmits it to an orbiter. That would be the MRO orbiter. And then the MRO orbiter turns to Earth and then sends all the data to the Deep Space Network. At that point, the Deep Space Network itself turns around, sends it to JPL and into the ground data systems. At that point, when it shows up, our team can take that data and decode it and see what happened during the flight. This flight control confirming that we have EVRs from Ingenuity. Ingenuity is reporting having performed spin-up, takeoff, climb, hover, descent, landing, touchdown, and spin down. And al altimeter data confirmed that Ingenuity has performed its first flight, the first flight of a powered aircraft on another planet. So the image we're looking at on the screen is the image from our onboard navigation camera showing us hovering above the surface of Mars. How incredible! <laughs> and that's its shadow, right Taryn? Yes, that's its shadow. So the onboard navigation camera points straight down, so we're seeing its shadow right now. <laughs> Are you guys seeing the Perseverance image? Saw that, Taryn. So, <laughs> so yes, ex explain what we just saw with the Perseverance image. So the Persever Perseverance image is showing us um, grounded at first. It's, it's actually a video, which is great. It's grounded at first and then shows us hovering our three meters above the Martian surface and then touching back down. It's amazing, brilliant. Everyone is, is super excited. <laughs> so I would say it's a success. I would say it's a success.